Okay. So, uh, second church I've gone to in the uh, in search for a church in Raleigh. Um, so, uh, overall thoughts: it was a bigger church than the uh, last one I went to. Um, probably, let's see. Actually, probably about ten times as many people. It's probably like a hundred versus ten. So it was definitely a bigger church. Um, so. One of the things is it said worship started at 1030. I got there at like 1028 and like the doors were closed already. <laughs> so it's like it, on your website, it says 1030. I got there on time. So how am I late? But I don't think I was that late. Like I, I got to the point where like, hey, are there any new people here? And I was like, yeah, a new person. So I wasn't that late. So um, but uh, let's see after that. Um, so. Uh, Unlike the first place, they had like a full choir at this place. And uh, one of the things I realized is when you have a lot of voices, it sounds really beautiful, but it's a little really hard to hear the lyrics. So at the last place, you could pretty clearly hear all the lyrics that the main like uh, woman was saying. But when you hear the lyrics, they're like, nah. whereas here, you really just got the beautiful symphony of like all the voices together. So it wasn't like as difficult or it wasn't, uh, like, you, you don't get any Jesus turned me to wine <laughs> type lyrics. Um, so, uh, yeah, the choir was really good. Um, so, uh, the speaker. Um, speaker, really great. Like, another guest speaker. For some reason, like, every church I've gone to so far has had a guest speaker, not, like, the actual normal pastor. I don't know if that's going to continue, but it'll be interesting to see. Um, it's actually overall very moving. Like music was great. Speaker was great. Like they prayed a lot. The one thing that ultimately I think was like, uh, is towards the end, they're like, medicine can't help you. And it wasn't even like in a, Hey, medicine, like God invented medicine. So God helps you type of thing through medicine. This is like, no medicine can't help you. And I'm like, you, you should still see a doctor if you're sick. God helped invent, God helped create people who created medicine. So it's like, if that's the logic you're going for, okay, but it didn't sound like that was what they were going for. That coupled with, like, my, my brain more went to the metaphor of, like, the comparison between the choirs. So, like, when you have one individual voice, it's a lot easier to understand what that voice is saying. But if it sounds stupid, it's also very easy to understand what the stupid person is saying. Whereas if you have a lot of voices, it's comparatively hard to understand what they're saying. But if it doesn't, if it's stupid, it's also less easy to tell that it's stupid. So my brain still went to a lot of those like high TE places. I did get a lot of FI passion out of it. Like it was a very moving ceremony. So I might go back. I have to see what where the other churches are. But um. Like, the main thrust of the speech is uh, God has a timeline for you. He may not do it at the pace you want or how you want it. So um, in due time, God will help me find the place, like the church that I'm supposed to be at <laughs> while I'm down here. But, um, yeah, overall, good church. Um, between the two, I think this is the one I would go back to so far. Um, I, I did like the energy at this church better. The speaker was better. The music was better. Um, really, the only thing that was kind of weird was, like, it was a black church, so I was, like, the only white dude. But they made me feel welcome. So, like, that wasn't really a big issue. I didn't really care about that. But um, let's see. So, yeah, interesting metaphor. More voices can be more beautiful but harder to understand. Less voices. Uh, one voice. Less, like... It is easier to understand, but if it sounds stupid, then you're you're, you're going to have to hear the stupidity of it. Um, and also, you know, God, God can help you, but you should still go see a doctor. God helps you through circumstances, and part of that includes doctors. So, yeah. Um, maybe it was a good church. I'll, I'll give that. Um, well, we'll see if uh, any of them can beat it.